it's still reading good. Yeah, it's still reading good. And it sounds like it's out of the hole. It's probably foil. That cow's not real happy. Oh, it's a coin. Looks to be a silver one too, 1954. Not what I'm looking for, but I'll take it. Silver is good any day of the week. Hi, how are you? Hey guys, I hope you're having an excellent day in the life. I know today's day in the life is very late. Really sorry for that. I had some technical difficulties yesterday. Just was a rough day in general yesterday. I'll probably share a little bit of that with you guys tomorrow. Um, I had to travel back to Unique Springs. It was just a rough day in general. But when I got home, I had two packages. So I thought I would do a little mail time with you guys today. Um, the first package comes from Mark Emmons and Digging It Tees, and I have a pretty good feeling I know what this is, so let's check it out here. I think this is going to be my t-shirt um, from the other night. If you guys were watching, I called into the History Seekers radio show, and I want a t-shirt, so I think that's what we're going to have here. Yeah, looks like it. This is going to be a t-shirt from the Zack Bird Adventure Hour. His new balling design. It's got the mini balls on it. And it says, balling since 1861, the Zack Bird Adventure Hour. So, really appreciate that. Big thanks to Mark over at Digging It Tees. I'll put a link uh, down to their site below here. And a big thanks to Zack Bird. Of course, I'll put a link to his site as well. And, uh, wow. This next uh, envelope comes from overseas somewhere. It says it's from Airmail. Royal Airmail. So I'm assuming maybe from England or... Ooh, that's a really cool card. It's got a picture of rifles on the front. Whoa. Wow. This is super cool. It says, Hi, Bird Dog. Just a few coins you can find in England metal detecting. Thought you might like them. The $2 bill and stamps I bought when I was in Tennessee in 1999 on holiday may be more use to you than me. Again, thanks for the eagle button. Keep up the good work, Richard. Wow. Thank you so much, Richard. That means a whole lot to me. All these coins will have a very special place in my collection. I don't have, uh, I think I only have one English coin that I found when I was out metal detecting with JD. So, wow. Oh, there are some amazing coins in here, Richard. So nice of you to do that. I appreciate it so much. Thank you to everyone who's been sending me stuff in. It's just... It is really cool when you guys reach out to me. It means so much. Thank you guys again. See you tomorrow.